start the proceedings. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Colors Night 2022. The chief guest for the day, the Vice Chancellor of the University of Colombo, Senior Professor H.D. Karnaratna, and other guests are arriving. Please rise to receive them.
A very good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nimutu Sirivardhana, and I'm accompanied with Dushani Gamage and Vinukti Smalfala. We together consider this as an absolute pleasure to be your host of one of the most anticipated and undoubtedly one of the most glamorous events of the University of Colombo, the Night of the Champions. Sportsmanship is not just about winning or losing. It's about showcasing your dedication, perseverance, and teamwork. So tonight, we celebrate that true spirit of sportsmanship, and we honor those champions. Ladies and gentlemen, the Department of Physical Education of the University of Colombo, together with the Amalgamated Club, has the honor in appreciating and awarding undoubtedly the skillful sportsmen and sportswomen of the University of Colombo who have brought honor to our alma mater during the year 2022. With that in mind, ladies and gentlemen, embrace yourselves because this is the, the Champions, Champions Night, Night 2022. 2022. To formally start off today's proceedings to lighting the traditional oil lamp, this cordial invitation goes to the following dignitaries. Senior Professor H.D. Karunaratna, the Vice Chancellor of University of Colombo, Dr. L.M. Kapila Bandara, the Chairman Sports Advisory Board of University of Colombo, Mr. K.A.S. Edward, the Registrar of University of Colombo, Dr. Pratibha Mahana Maheva, the Rector of Sri Pali Campus, the Dean of Faculty of Medicine, the Dean of Faculty of Arts, the Dean Faculty of Management and Finance, the Dean of Faculty of Nursing, the Dean Faculty of Education, the Dean Faculty of Law, and also the Dean Faculty of Graduate Studies, the Dean Faculty of Indigenous Medicine, the Bursa of the University of Colombo, the Director of the University of Colombo School of Computing, the Director of the Institute of Human Resource Advancement, Mr. Sanjeev Ajay Singh, the Acting Director of the Department of Physical Education, University of Colombo. Mrs. Vasantha Ratnayaka, Instructor in Physical Education, representing all instructors. And representing the sponsors, Mr. Dilshan Rodrigo, the COO of the Hatton National Bank, and also the President and the Secretary of the Amalgamated Club to do the honors of lighting the traditional oil lamp.
Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, kindly remain standing for the national anthem. Here, you may now be seated. In keeping with our time-honored traditions, we begin this ceremony with a traditional puja dance performance. Our very own University of Colombo Dancing Circle is here with us all set to bring you a mesmerizing performance. So without further ado, let's welcome our dancers on stage. Let's go, 
Thank you, ladies, for that mesmerizing performance. And with that, now it's time for a little recap of 2022. And now let us pay our attention to this video clip.
Moving on with today's proceedings, it's my great pleasure to introduce Mr. Harit Lokugamage, the president of the Amalgamated Club, to deliver the welcome address. Senior Professor Chair, Professor H.D. Karanathna, Dr. Kapil Bandara, the Sports Adults Board Chairman, Professor Pratibha Mahanama, and other distinguished guests, and my dear colleagues, the hardworking athletes of University of Colombo, a warm welcome to each and everyone present here today. Let us first sit back and reminisce about the turbulent year we had in 2022. Physical activities had come to a standstill and at the university for over two years. Tournaments had no hope of happening. Forget tournaments. It was almost impossible for players to gather and conduct practice sessions due to COVID-19 guidelines. We had the Champions Night for the year 2019, 2020, and 2021 last year, and yet we couldn't see the glamour in your faces since we had to wear masks again due to COVID-19 regulations. Come 2022, the Department of Physical Education took over the daunting task of reigniting the sports at the university with the support of the Sports Advisory Board headed by Dr. Kapila Bandara and the watchful guidance of the Vice Chancellor. And in the month of March, we formed our Amalgamated Club for the year 2022. The past year was nothing less than remarkable for we had tough obstacles and a high level of uncertainty prevailing in the country and a tougher set of resilient individuals who were ready to take on whatever the challenge that comes their way and ensure sports at UOC rises back to its former glory. I'm extremely proud of the Amalgamated Club of 2022 for taking on the challenging task of filling your seniors' shoes. Most of us were freshers in 2019 and two years were completely taken away by us. And also the exposure, the experience, and the memories of winning and losing. And yet, we became the leaders of UOC sports in 2022, and did our best to reawaken the spirit of UOC sports. None of this would have been possible, even in the slightest ways, if not for the constant, unwavering support and en encouragement of the Department of Physical Education and the Acting Director, Mr. Sanjeeva Jaisinghe, along with Dr. Kapila Bandara, the Sports Advisory Board Chairman, and most definitely the Vice Chancellor, Senior Professor H.D. Karanathna. An entire year has passed. You would have won, you would have lost, had off days at practice, and had the days where you had the best session of your life. But one thing for sure, each and every one of you gave your best for the university, shedding blood, sweat, and tears. Today is a day to celebrate your precious moments shared as a team and as individuals, celebrating sportsmanship and teamwork. At the end of the day, being awarded today for your effort on the field is a destination where some would have not had the chance of getting to yet. But remember, it is a journey that you spend with your team whom you call as family that matters the most. We might not see some of these faces at the grounds or the indoor gym anymore, including myself, but we must make sure to always extend a helping hand to our upcoming teams in the years to come and be an example to the youngsters and show sports is not just an activity, it is a lifestyle. With that being said, I would like to conclude my speech as the president of the American Red Club, congratulating all my dear champions here today. Enjoy the rest of the evening and witness the proud achievements of our fellow champions. Thank you. Thank you, Harith. We now move towards the first set of awards in the Colors Awarding Ceremony 2022, that is for the distribution of merit awards. And for this occasion, this cordial invitation goes to Mr. Sanjeeva Jaisinghe, Acting Director of Physical Education, accompanied by Mr. Kavidu Abesinghe, Temporary Instructor in Physical Education.
Firstly, merit awards for Rovig women, JMTC Gajanayaka, CB Gane Goda, KABK Vijayaratna, ST Jayakodi, AMGS Adhikari, AP Samaranayaka, SD Vijayanayaka, PNV Record, PRCK Paul Gampala and SS Masako Rala. Next up is Merit Awards for Road Race Men, HWB Hasarindu. Merit Awards for Track and Field Men. AID Gunaratna. Merit Awards for Track and Field Women, WP Hasini Maduka. LMMDH Gunaratna. Merit Awards for Weightlifting Men, LPN Shalinda. WSHMK Herat Thank you, sir. You may take your seats. With that, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to invite, representing our main sponsor in this evening, from HNB, I would like to invite the Chief Operating Officer of HNB, Mr. Dishan Rodrigo, on stage to address the gathering. Professors, learned, learned lecturers, students, ladies and gentlemen. It is uh, truly a privilege for me to be invited to address you today. We at HNB are proud to be associated with the University of Colombo, the premier educational institution in the country that has contributed in numerous ways to various spheres in the country, education, sports, research, innovativity, innovation, and entrepreneurship, and the list can go on. I have recently witnessed how progressive the medical faculties under the visionary leadership of your dean, the senior professor Kanura Ratna, uh, having been involved in the annual conference sessions a few months back. Uh, I have fond memories of conducting a technical session on entrepreneurship in this very auditorium uh, a, few, uh, a few months back. So HNB is no stranger to all of you. It's a mass market bank. Uh, we were known for saving and thrift in our initial days. And today, we are into digital banking and uh, financial inclusion, and also bringing everyone into the formal economy. Uh, so we can really partner with the University of Columbia, and we are already doing that. My colleagues, uh, uh, Sumati, uh, Saumya, uh, from the bank who are here, have been working very, very closely uh, with you uh, in terms of becoming the preferred banking partner 
uh, to the faculty, to the students, uh, the employment also of your graduates in the bank, uh, partner you also in your research and community, CSR programs, a lot of areas for us to actually support you. Uh, so let me first congratulate all of you students on your achievements. All of you are role models for balancing education with sports. Today is a colors night. That's why you are here. Uh, sports has always been a part of my life. I took part in uh, most sports in school, whether it's badminton, tennis, uh, cricket, uh, table tennis, swimming, but was never good enough to meet the first team in any sport. Uh, even today, I'm an avid sportsman, and I'm proud that I can still wear my wedding trouser to work and equally fit as I was when I was 20. I allocate an hour every day for sport, and it's a vital part of my life, and I believe that really helps you to build stamina to overcome uh, any illness, particularly in today's times. Uh, I know I have a very few uh, minutes left, just 10 minutes, so I'd like to leave you with three messages. Uh, for the students. The first is to help the country transition to a production economy. Uh, you're all beneficiaries of a free education system. You all need to be mindful to give back to your country. I know this time last year, we were in a very, very serious, precarious situation. Sri Lanka had just defaulted on its sovereign debt. Uh, people were on the streets. There was Aragalia and a perception that there was no future, that we were a lost cause. Today, things are very different. There is a positive business sentiment, and there is hope in our hearts. Uh, and as a country, we need to transition from an import-dependent, welfare and subsidy-dependent economy that has been living beyond its means to a country that is known for value-add, value-add in everything we do. I remember when I worked in apparel, there was a lot of investment made to transition to become a value-added supplier. I used to work for a company called Brandix. Uh, so it's very easy in any industry to sell the commodity, whether it's tea, sell the tea in its raw form, or if it is rubber, sell the rubber in its milk form, uh, if it is uh, coconut in its husk form, if it is gems, just sell the gems as it is. Uh, but the real value, the value addition that you can bring in is what brings uh, employment to all of you, and that is where your value add comes in. And that is what is needed for the country. We need to move on from that. Even when it comes to services, how do we add value without exporting uh, you know, housemaids into the Middle East? How can we actually look at nurses, caregivers, you know, there is every sphere in this country, there is opportunity for value addition, and that is real revenue, foreign exchange to the country. And that is where all of you can support in terms of, uh, uh, you know, contributing uh, to the country's development efforts. If you must go overseas, still there are opportunities for you to uh, support this university in terms of research, in terms of funding, in terms of knowledge sharing, in, in, in numerous ways. So your country really needs you. That's the first message. Second message is to develop a performance mindset versus an entitled mindset. Um, entitlements is about what is due to me, right? Performance is about how do I add value what is beyond what is uh, expected from me. In my life, I have worked across many industries, positions, and always wanted to add value and deliver more than what was expected. So I took, a, took on bigger challenges, many outside my core areas, right? Whenever anybody gave me a challenge, I took it on head on. Uh, so in such a situation, you don't need to fight for your rights. You will be recognized and you, and you will always be able to progress in your career. Uh, whereas if you have an entitlement mindset, you're always asking for what is due for you. I need my one hour lunch break. I need to work and leave at five o'clock. You know, that, that culture is something that we need to move away from. And the third area is to plan your life carefully. 
Do you want to be, when you get into employment, do you want to be a big fish in a small pond or a small fish in a big pond? Have big goals. A lot of hard work, grit, and determination is required to succeed. Right? So if you take uh, Muttaya Murlidharan, my favorite sportsman, he comes uh, to Australia where I go uh, quite often. You know, he would have bowled a million balls to get that level of skill. That's the amount of effort he would have put in day after day, hour after hour, to get to that level of skill. So uh, don't get caught to get rich quick schemes. Life is a marathon, not a 100-yard sprint. Uh, there are many scams around. As a banker, I have seen where people get caught to pyramid schemes, crypto schemes, uh, unauthorized financial institutions, all with the intention of trying to get rich quickly. Right, so be wary, you know, have big goals, but you need to put in the effort, you need to put in the uh, drive to make it work. If something is coming easily, then it can't, it's too good to be true, it won't happen. So I think those are the three messages that I wanted to share with you. Uh, once again, it's been a real pleasure for me to be here and an honor. I wish you all the very best uh, to achieving your dreams, uh, not only for yourself, but also for the university and for the country. Thank you. Introducing the all-new Solo Wallet. Now, Solo by HNB is equipped with a digital wallet feature with added benefits. With Solo, you can now transfer money between any two bank accounts. Send funds from one Solo Wallet to another Solo Wallet. With Solo, you can pay all your utility bills. Make remote payments via direct pay. Enjoy deals, coupons and loyalty rewards at your favorite merchants every time you use the app. With the cash to mobile feature, withdraw cash from any HNB ATM without a debit card. Solo by HNB is the ultimate wallet that enables convenient and secure transactions. Download Solo by HNB today and enjoy cashless convenience. Solo by HNB, the only digital wallet you need. Thank you very much sir, for your words, and please may I invite you on stage for the awarding of the next set of colors. And the next set of awarding of colors will be accompanied by Mrs. Iresha Madhuvanti, the instructor in physical education. With that, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to start off the awarding of colors for the year 2022. First, Awarding colors for basketball men. LVW Fembeck. KNS Disanayaka. MTBS Jayaratna. K-A-R-S Kotage D-E-B Dias M-M-A-K Gunaratna G. H. Lakmal T. A. P. Pratibha Poorna K. D. J. Tenja R.A.P.D. Vikramatilaka D.W.D. Hoyt And finally, W.G.L. Gisilu 
with that, we are moving on to awarding colors for shooting sport men. We have J.R.D. Sensen Jayavardhana. And next, we have the awarding of colors for football women. RMPA Rajapaksha. And next, we have awarding of colors for Kabaddi men. PDMSA Ranwala. GDT Leela Ratna. And next, ladies and gentlemen, for the first time in the University of Colombo history, we have awarding of colors for blind cricket men. AMST Karuna Ratna. And also we have T. Yogaraj. And next, para athletic men, W A N A Vijay Singh. Thank you, sir, and madam. Let me take your seats. To distribute the next set of colors and colors awards. This cordial invitation goes to Mr. K. R. D. C. Ratnamudali, the Director of Physical Education, University of Boratua, former Secretary General of Sri Lanka University Sports Association, Vice President Sri Lanka Volleyball Federation, and Secretary General of Sri Lanka Beach, Ball, Beach Volleyball Federation. And I also invite Mr. Ajanta Dahanayaka, instructing physical education, to accompany him. Taekwondo women, V. Kirti Ratna, A. F. Ishka, M. S. T. Piris. P. A. H. Hansima WMU Fernando T. Abirama Nextly, volleyball men, NMLD Seneviratna, DN Sandarwan, KMA Ashinsana, VI Silva, HPDV Kumar. MLC Manan Kanda, SMMR Bandara, HMSS Bandara, DG Madhava, OI Jai Singha, MMBU Mahi Pala
and be Tirulog Chandran. And the Volleyball Men Re Awards, AABW Amarakon and EPBS Saranga. Thank you, sir. You may have your seats. Thank you, sir. And to award the next set of colors, may I invite Mr. H.M.G. P.R.A. Bandar, the Deputy Registrar of the Faculty of Medicine of the University of Colombo, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Samira Madhushankar, Instructor in Physical Education. The next set of colors awards will be for cricket men. Cricket men. B. Jatushan. MPP Sachinta. GBR Arvinda. CTA Shafter SD Gunavardana PG Madhusara PPGSM Chandasiri M A R P Seniviratna R A L H Randini W S V V Rakodi K A Y S Karavita And next, colors will be re-awarded for the year 2022 for the sport in cricket men. P-L-A-N Lianage. D-B Lianadur. K-B-A-D-S-D Bandara. EKSK Agal MLSR Abhevardana PMN Ratnayaka Ladies and gentlemen, next we are awarding colors for blind cricket men. T. Yogaraj. Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time in the history of the University of Colombo, the University of Colombo has the honor in presenting these colors for the wonderful bright cricket team of our university. So please join with me for a big round of applause to the colorsmen from blind cricket men. And also we have the para-athletic men, ladies and gentlemen, please join with me for the voting of colors for para-athletic men.
Thank you, sirs. Moving on to awarding colors for basketball and carom. For the presentation of awards, I cordially invite Mr. Rahal Aberatna, the works engineer, University of Colombo, accompanied by instructor in physical, Mrs. Iresha Madhuanti. Colors Awards for Basketball Women. It's our Malavige. UT Andrews. W F O E Vikramasinghe T Vimaladharma T M Katagode KJ AL Randika B Sandirateva MD Ruan Patiran W. A. K. Gimhani PhD Lochana ASS Vitanagi SN Ferdinando Re awarding colors for basketball women it's I Ube Vikrama Awarding colors for Karam men NGLAJ Prasad DS Ruan Kumar HM Vijay Dungu WSHC Jairatna AGK Darshan MMNS Fernando D 
NB Kularatna. Re-awarding colours for Karam Min. KANB Rajaratna. Thank you very much sir, for joining and please be on stage to receive your special token of appreciation from Mrs. Iresha Madhuvanti, the instructor in physical education. Thank you. The next set of awarding of colours. Please may I invite Ms. JTL Dharmasena, the Bursa of the University of Colombo on stage and she will be accompanied by Mrs. Nayanti Chandrasena, the instructor in physical education. And now, in the next segment, the colors will be awarded to volleyball women. RAC Tarundi. KDMC Naratna TMS Ishara ADU Hansini NVP Shashini Sena Ratna BGHC Karuna Ratna JMJMS Jai Singh KMID Tamil WPH Maduka HSD Gunatilaka Apologies HSD Janatilaka GKTT Javardana Next, colors will be re awarded for the year 2022 for volleyball women. EDJ Chaturya AC Summer Parlor DGIS Vijay Ratna Next ladies and gentlemen we are awarding colors for road race men WMS Ishara WMP Veera Singh WHKE Mendes Madam, please remain on stage to receive our token of appreciation from Instruct in Physical Education.
Thank you, madam. Next, ladies and gentlemen, we are moving on with an entertainment item. So please welcome on stage Nimna Krishan and Sachinina Vanjana from the Dancing Circle of the University of Colombo. Thank you very much for that lovely performance. To distribute Colors Awards for track and field women and wrestling men, this cordial invitation goes to Dr. Chaturanga Ranasinghe, the Director of Exercise in Sports Medicine Unit and Member of Sports Advisory Board of University of Colombo. And he will be accompanied by Mr. Sujan Valgampaya, Instructor in Physical Education.
Track and Field Women Colors Awards, UT Andrews. AI Patirage. WSA Fernando. HFSP Fonseca. MSC Zoiza. DLU Vibaladharma. DRPDK Dasanayaka. ADU Hansini. KEMN Yasasmini. DDM Harish Chandra and S. Shankavi. Wrestling Men Colors Awards, BHA Helmala, ODBO Vitanagi, MFA Ahmed. R H M H N Vijay Ratna, M A A Ilham, K L A P S Lienge. SPG JD Bimsara GDKM Gama Gamhevagi Wrestling Men Re Awards KWW Prasad AJC Gunavardhana So please remain on stage to receive your token of appreciation To give away the token of appreciation this invitation goes to Sachit Fernando of uh, Sachit Fernando the editor of the Amalgamated Club, and David De Silva, the Vice President of the Amalgamated Club. Thank you, sir. Awarding colors for rugby. I cordially invite Dr. Sajit Vishankar, head of the Department of International Business, University of Colombo, and member of Sports Advisory Board of Colombo. He
by Mrs. Vasanta Ratnaik, Vasanta Ratnaik, Vasanta Ratnaik, Instructor in Physical Education. Colors Awards for Rugby Men M.T. Surabira M.A.V. Lochana H.N. Amaratunga A.I. P.S.N. W.V. D.S. Stephen R.P. Vikash A.P. L.D.A. Kaushal P.U.M. Paduk M.K.H. Fernando E.M.S.U. Mahanama D.S.R. Vijay Surya G. Nanaya Kara S. T. S. Rodrigo G. D. K. M. Gumhevagi RML Madhuanta JT Abesuria BDR Sandaruan B.C. Tenacon K.C. H.D. Abe Gunavardana Re-awarding colors for rugby men H.M. Lokugamage K. 
KBD Prabhashna. JD Virakkodi. SPA UM Theories Sir, I kindly request you to remain on stage and I invite the respective instructor to present the token of appreciation. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, the guest of honor for the Colors Night at the University of Colombo for the year 2022, Retired General Daya Ratnaika is now arriving. Please rise to receive him. A very warm welcome to you, sir, to the Colors Night of the University of Colombo for the year 2022. And with that, let's continue with the day's proceedings. Dr. Kapila Bandara is the Chairman of the Sports Advisory Board and the Dean of the Faculty of Education of the University of Colombo. Dr. Kapila Bandara is a sports enthusiast who will be present at the Indoor Gymnasium every morning playing the game of badminton, which evidently shows his enduring passion towards sports. He is a strong pillar who guided and supported us in every possible way to achieve the inter-university titles. It is my utmost pleasure to invite Dr. Kapila Bandara, Chairman, Sports Advisory Board, University of Colombo, and Dean of Faculty of Education, University of Colombo, to address the gathering. Thank you very much for your kind words, and very good evening to all of you. Guest of honor, of the today's event, General Daya Ratnayaka, a former army commander of the Sri Lankan army, as well as the former chief of staff in Sri Lankan army. Chief guest of the today's event, senior professor, the vice chancellor, D. Karan Ratna, the vice chancellor of the University of Colombo, rector, Sri Pali campus, deans of the faculties of the University of Colombo, directors of the institutes of the University of Colombo, and Mr. K. S. Edward, the register of the University of Colombo, the bursa, and all the administrative staff of the University of Colombo, Mr. Sanjeeva Jayasinghe, Secretary, Sports Advisory Board, as well as the director of the physical education, all the instructors, staff members of the physical education department, the University of Colombo, President, Secretary, Treasurer, and all the members of the Amalgamated Club, very especially Colors recipients and ladies and gentlemen. It is indeed a great honor as the Chairman of the Sports Advisory Board of the University of Colombo to have this opportunity to express few words in this 
Colors Awarding Ceremony in 2022. I'm ha happy to inform you that we are celebrating this particular event after the remarkable achievement at the Inter-University Championship in 2022. And we are holding this event in a moment where our sportsmen and women are preparing to participate in Sri Lankan University Games, which is scheduled to have in July, which is our main purpose to get the uh, remarkable achievement even at this particular event. I think this event would be a very motivative event to get the uh, wonderful achievement in this particular uh, Sri Lankan University Games. As you all are aware, the Colors Awarding Ceremony is a major and significant annual event of the university calendar. This also is a great and remarkable lifetime experience for you as a university student. All your effort dedication and commitment in your sports activities while engaging in your academic activities are rewarded today. We know that it is challenging to parallelly manage both academic activities and sports, but today you reap the outcomes of what you have invested in. Your individual commitment as an athlete, athlete has brought glory not only for you, uh, yourself, but also to the university. Therefore, this vibrant event denotes your individual contribution to the university sports. I congratulate each one of you and appreciate your conti contribution towards uplifting the sports of the University of Colombo. Dear students, as you know, we all live in an increasingly volatile, uncertainty, and complex, ambiguous world. It is difficult to fathom this complexity due to the rapid advancement of technology and unprecedented challenges driven by the accelerating globalization. As a result, we are entering into a society that nobody has experienced ever before. In this context, we have to prepare ourselves for the jobs that have not yet been created. We have to prepare ourselves to solve problems that have not yet been anticipated. So in order to cope with these emerging situations, you all should have certain competencies such as problem solving, creativity, team working, collaboration to approach complex challenges. In addition, you should have character qualities such as initiative, persistence, adaptability, leadership, confidence, social and cultural awareness to move with the challenge, change in environment. So there are ample research evidence to prove that sport is an effective weapon that mainly contributes to develop above attributes of an individual. For an example, I am holding two responsible positions in our university as a dean faculty of education, as well as the chairman of the sports advisory board of the University of Colombo. I believe that the confidence capacity and the other qualities which I needed to undertake this two position have been obtained from sports and other extracurricular activities that I engage in during my university and school period. Dear student, I'm proud to say that you as a sports men and women, you have already acquired the qualities that I mentioned and you entered into society with these attributes. I am confident that you are now prepared and you are equipped with the required capabilities to face any challenge and take any responsibilities that you encounter in your life. That is heritage for being engaged in sports. 
as a chairman of the sports advisory board of the University of Colombo, I'm very happy to say that I have had an opportunity to contribute to the university sports, and I am fortunate to have a good leadership. He's very loud sports, and always we can get guidance and advice to promote sports in the university. Also, I fortunate to have a dedicated and very talented team from the Department of Physical Education in carrying out my responsibilities. So therefore, I take this opportunity to thank the, all the members of the organizing committee of this event and the members of the Amalgamated Club for brilliantly organized this Colors Award in ceremony. I believe without your commitment and enthusiasm, this event would not have been uh, possible. Before concluding my words, let me welcome our guest of honor, General Daya Ratnayak. And I want to thank, on behalf of the university, I want to thank you, sir, for accepting our invitation to deliver the keynote speech in this brilliant event. So thank you very much for accepting this amid very busy schedule. So thank you so much for giving this opportunity. Thank you. Thank you very much sir, for your words and thank you very much for the service that you do to the university as the chairman of the sports advisory board in uplifting sports at the University of Colombo. With that, ladies and gentlemen, we are going back with the voting of colors. And for the next segment, I would like to invite Professor Nihal Padmasiri, the head of the Department of Business Economics of the University of Colombo and the director of Career Guidance Unit of the University of Colombo, and also a member of the Sports Advisory Board, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Anusha De Silva, the instructor in physical education. Avoiding colors for weightlifting men. RDV Fernando. P. M. Malavana My apologies, P. M. Malavana H. M. Lukugamagi S. S. Jagoda D. L. R. Pereira N. O. W. Villavarachi N. D. D. Chandrasekara and R.P. Vikash. Next, ladies and gentlemen, awarding colors for badminton men. V. Kuruneru. R.M.J.K. Mutukuda. P. D. K. Chamudita H. D. V. Harish Chandra C. S. Ile Perumarachi M A D H Shehan S Tarshan
rewarding colors for badminton for the year 2022 are nilakshan the next set of colors will be awarded for chess men b o mirisage N I I the good. K C K Silva. L E V the singer. Re-awarding colors for chess men for the year 2022. B D S Mendes. S M D Surya Bandar. D G M S Doluvira. and hcj gamage thank you very much and please remain on stage to receive your special token of appreciation by mr anush de silva the instructor in physical education thank you sirs Distribute the colors for the game of baseball. Baseball. This cordial invitation goes to Professor Sagar Chandrasekhar, the director, Institute of Human Resources Advancement, University of Colombo, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Sujan Valgampaya, instructor in physical education. Baseball men, B. S. Sena Ratna, Y. K. Jayavira, W. A. B. M. Vikramasinghe. K M B S Kulasekara, K A Y S Karavita, M A W Jayasurya. G W J V Mahindra Ratna, R A R A M P R I Ratna, H A U Niranjala. K I P Dasun, D T Gamage, D P M Pereira.
R M B A R Bandara. A G T G A Silva. N N Shifran. D M J S B Disanayaka. DGS Hematilaka and men's baseball re awards KGHA Ratnaika Thank you sir please remain on stage to receive your token of appreciation to give away the token of appreciation, this invitation goes to Sujan Valgampai, the instructor in physical education. Thank you very much, sirs. Awarding colors for LA. To present the awards for LA, I cordially invite Dr. Ajanta Atukorala, the Director of the University of Colombo School of Computing, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Samir Madhushankar, Instructor in Physical Education. Awarding colors for LA men. LKT Sasanka. MKGS Vishwanta. A.K. Lanerol R.P.S.R. Lakmal M.T.D.M. Sandarwan DHC Myranga KANDD Koditoaku KWSP Sugatadasa RD Deva Sumitra WKS Viduranga AAM Nafris JPT Jayavira AGB Abenaika AAHS Saman Ratna
R A D O Kavishan. SBY MTD Sivratna Re awarding colors for LA men SS Dahanayaka PHR PM Abhay Singh HR Kure BWS Madushan And next re awarding colors for LA women A Bimasha Shamali With that, I kindly request Dr. Ajanta Atukorala to remain on stage and to present this token of appreciation. I invite Mr. Samira Madhushankar, instructor in physical education. Thank you. Sri Lanka is a country with a unique cultural heritage that has been passed down through generations. The folk dancers in Sri Lanka express the diverse lifestyles of Sri Lankan communities and reflect our vibrant culture. Now, to reflect, uh, refresh your minds, I would like to invite you all to join us as our own undergraduates of the UOC Dancing Circle showcase the beauty of Sri Lankan folk dance.
Thank you very much for that very elegant performance. Next up is the award of colors for the game of hockey women's. And to distribute the colors, this cordial invitation goes to Professor Kamal Pereira, the Dean, Faculty of Indigenous Medicine, University of Colombo. And he will be accompanied by Mrs. Iresha Madhuwanti, instructor in physical education. Hockey Women Color Awards, KDYK Veera Singha. BGHI Guruge. SAN Netsarani. GHA Manatunga. G K I Premachandra U W D K Veera Singha R I Ranaveera T.T. Sinhara Mundalike H.M.M.S.L. Herat HKRM Lakshani AADUS Abe Singha IKSW Sirvardhana SU Ratnayaka WBKIV Rakhodi HASH Pereira K A B K Vijay Ratna
ಟಿ ಟೇ ಡಿ ಗುಣಸೇಖರ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಾಕಿ ವಿಮೆನ್ ರೀ ಅವಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಲರ್ಸ್ ಎಚ್ ಎನ್ ವಿಧಾನ ಪಾತಿರನ್ So please remain on your stage to receive the token of appreciation from Mrs. Siresha Madhuvanthi. Thank you sir and madam. Up next, awarding of colors for karate. I cordially invite Prof. A. A. Aziz, the Dean, Faculty of Graduate Studies, University of Colombo, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Ajanta Dahanayaka, instructor in physical education. Colors Awards for Karate Women, M.O.M.R. Lianagay. TWDB Sirimanna EGD Dulanji PMB Dilshani GN Hevage HWN Amaya MPGN Patirana S. Sewandi P. S. K. Dikwell again Next, re-awarding colors for karate women Y. A. D. S. Supunsara GNS Ubay Tilak Next up awarding colors for karate men RMBLB Ratnayaka STB Jay Tilak ad b d chaturanga j s kuruppu r c s ranasinghe L. Varnakula Surya G. N. Gamage Re-awarding Colors for Karate Men SDK Vikram Singh P 
as Munasingha. I kindly request you to remain on stage and this token of appreciation will be presented by Mr. Ajant Dahanayaka, Instructor in Physical Education. Thank you. To award the next set of colours, may I invite Professor S.S.P. Varnukula Surya, the Dean, Faculty of Nursing, University of Colombo, who will be accompanied by Mr. Sujan Valdampaya, the instructor in physical education. Ladies and gentlemen, we will be awarding colours for swimming men. D.A.M. Vanduragala. Jai Sekara H A K Eranda H O C Hiripitia M. M. Kote Arachi B. A. C. Dharmasena M. P. K. H. Dias And rewarding colors for the year 2022 for swimming men. MP De Silva. Next, awarding colors for table tennis men. RAPD Vikramatilaka. ST Palihavadana WKS Viduranga ST Vikramasinghe MD Vikramasinghe WARA Karunasena YK Jayavira The awarding colors for table tennis men. T. Agashan. Ladies and gentlemen, next we're going to award colors for badminton women. A.P. Samaranayaka. D.S. Mallikarachi D.P.V.T.M. Kirtisiri D.N. Vijayanarayana ALT Ruanima JMS Sansala
SAS Chamali. Pre awarding colors for badminton women NK Tenakon. So please remain on stage to receive your token of appreciation from Mrs. Ujan Valgampaya, the instructor in physical education. Thank you, sirs. Next up, ladies and gentlemen, is the awarding of colors for the games of track and field and swimming. For this occasion, this cordial invitation goes to Professor Upul Sonnadar, the Dean, Faculty of Science, University of Colombo, and he will be accompanied by Ms. Nayanti Chandrasena, Instructor in Physical Education. Track and Field Men, the Colors Awards, K.K. Nilavira, M.A. Zulfan, S.D. Veera Singh, KDLD Diabru, MKS Nishanda, MAA Sandeepa. SKR Vaduarachi DUC Seniviratna I am Rupa Vansa SK Sudarshana WHKE Mendis VN Muhandiram S. Tarsikan SR Harshan M Khajavaran and the rewarding of colors to track and field men K D I P Karuna Tilakar. And P G G C Ranavira. Next up is distribution of colors for swimming women's. WARD Fernando. T 
TMDD Patiraja. LCN Fernando. RGP Navela. And rewarding of colors for swimming women. DAJ Munasingha. R. Vikrabha Gabage. Awarding Colors of Football Men. A. A. D. M. Abesingha. A. I. D. Gunaratna. C. M. Marmage. Z. Akil. J. R. M. Raiseldin. J. C. Korala. K. P. H. M. Patirana. H. R. M. in Fasi. S. Priyajan. N. P. E. D. Abheratna. M. Falil. WMS Ishara NMR Mipe N Vikramasinghe V. Nanaya Kara L. Jeremy M. Mushahid M H M Altaf P Madanaika M H M Israt H. A. Ahmad M. N. Abdullah Rewarding Colors of Football Men's
NHC DA De Silva. So please remain on stage to receive your token of appreciation from Ms. Nayanthi Chandrasena, the instructor in physical education. Thank you, sir, and madam. Awarding of colors for tennis and chess. I cordially invite Professor Lasantha Manavadu, the Dean, Faculty of Arts, University of Colombo. He will be accompanied by Mrs. Vasantha Ratnayaka, instructor in physical education. Awarding colors for tennis men. PM Vijayavira. ISM Fernando ML Hetiheva MAM Marker M.D. Vikram Singha S.D. Vikram Singha P.H.B. Pereira G.B.J. Jai Kodi K.R.T.T. Pires Tennis Women K.P.P.J. Chandasiri K.A.T.K. Silva A.P.D. Pereira A.M. Ama A.V. Adrisingha Ladies and gentlemen, let's put your hands together to felicitate our champions tonight. Re-awarding colors for tennis women, K.A.D.C. Pereira. In Satya Murthy. PDR Tatsarani We now move on to awarding colors for chess women MUVN Pereira H.I. Anjani R.M.S. Bandara H.M.A. Herat
Why you come again? D.S. Pereira B.A.S.H. Balasuria BGNNN Karunal Tilaka Sir, please remain on stage and accept this token of appreciation from Mrs. Vasanta Ratnaika, Instructor in Physical Education. Thank you. Distribute the Colors Awards for Men's Taekwondo and Netball. This quality invitation goes to Professor MPP Dharmadasa, the Dean, Faculty of Management and Finance, University of Colombo, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Sujan Valgampaya, Instructor in Physical Education. Taekwondo Men's, WKP Balivatta. S.A. Vetta Singha. K.N.D. Fernando. G.H. Vijay Ratna. KD Vikramasekara SP Rupa Singha AP Benedict H. J. R. Achi The re-awarding of colors for Taekwondo Men's H. T. S. J. Madhushankar M. D. 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 Costa It's M R N Madhuanta. A A U Geetma. Next up is Netball Colors Awards for Netball. S T Jai Singh. A.P. Davy Pereira S.S. Gamage H.S.R. Sanjeeva B.H. Molly Goddard K.M. Nishanta
IC Pereira. LK Purnima. AAS Gamage. MDN Amaranaika and UT Andrews and Netball Women's Rewarding of Colors for BASH Balasuria. Awarding colors for rowing men. In Ashraf. J.S. Cruz. W.A.T. Rupa Singha. PHGP Kaludilaka PVAB Pereira BMF Fernando LMSN Vanika Segara J A D O Chintila W A A P S Vikramasinghe D R R Ratna W A L Kavishka LVN Vijay Tunga KSS Defonseca VV Lankeshwara W L A R S Valvita W W M A T B Medavata Pre awarding colors for rowing men for the year 2022 SSRV Rasekara LDS Dinusha MG SD Vijay Tilaka Colors for Rowing Women S Ganeshini So please remain on stage to receive your token of appreciation from Mr. Sujan Valgampaya, the instructor in physical education. Thank you, sirs. Awarding of colors for hockey and table tennis. I cordially invite Mr. K.A.S. Edward, the Registrar of the University of Colombo, and he will be accompanied by Mrs. Vasanta Ratnayaka, 
instructor in physical education. The boarding colors for hockey men. RT BD and Ashanta. M.A.A.D. Malavi Arachi D.C.S. Tilakaratna T.P.S. Sachinta M.I.I. Ahmad G.S.H. Pereira P.B.W. Senaviratna AJD Abhi Singh KD Vijay Singh MY Kavinda WD Kaushalya MFA Arshad RDJD Vipulasiri AMMHV Abhay Singh WND Herat WJ Tisaru TMTS Tenacon Re Awarding Colors for Hockey Men P. D. A. Chirantana Moving on to presenting colors awards for table tennis women D. M. T. G. Dasanayaka K. S. Udayangi HMKC Herat APDB Pereira KKDP Deudini R A N K C Ranavaka N U T Anuradha B M M S Jayatilaka
sir and madam please remain on stage we will be now recognizing and appreciating a set of individuals who are highly highly relevant and who are highly involved in the success of each and every one of you they are none other than the coaches of the university of colombo so i request the audience to please give them a huge round of applause as they are the true strength of your success starting off with basketball men's coach mr c g danavan sir the coach of boxing men mr w m a r wakadapola the coach of chess men and women mr n t amarakon the coach of l men mr p a n chandrajeeva the coach of football men mr b m s basnayaka the coach of hockey men's and women mr rohan Ro rohan disanayaka the coach of karate men and women mr h m s kumar the coach of netball ms p m s abey gunawadana the coach of women's rowing mr mrs ms k s w abeyratnam the coach of men's rugby mr k d sudat sampat the coach of swimming men and women mr k d h vijayanth the coach of tennis men and women mr silvester francis the coach of women's volleyball miss w a s kokila the coach of kabaddi mr ranjit asoka and now we will be now we will be felicitating the supporting staff firstly representing the office staff mrs pushpakanti de silva representing the strength training hall mr ranjit asoka mr nuwan ranathunga Mr Deepal Padma Kumar So please remain on stage to receive the token of appreciation and to give away the token of appreciation this invitation goes to the junior treasurer Avishka Chirantha and assistant secretary Kitma Diranavak of the Amalgamated Club
Thank you, sir and madam. Well, now, ladies and gentlemen, after awarding the colours for the outstanding sportsmen and sportswomen of our alma mater, before going on with the special awards, we are moving on with an entertainment performance. To be more specific on this entertainment performance, ladies and gentlemen, it has been performed by our very own Sanju Vikramasinghe. He is the current student ambassador of the International Federation of University Sports Association and also the founding president of the dancing circle of the University of Colombo. And not only that, he was a former captain of the karate team of the University of Colombo. And also, he is currently a proud graduate from the Faculty of Management and Finance, getting a first-class honors degree in his final examination. So, please join with me to welcome our very own Sanjoya on stage. Big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen, to Mr. Sancho Vikrama Singha. Well, the University of Colombo has been performing immensely well during the past season in terms of the national achievements as well as in the inter-university arena. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now going to award the special awards for the representation in the national arena and well as in the inter-university sphere by our very own athletes. To start off with the awarding, let me invite the Dean, Faculty of Medicine, Professor Vajra Disanayaka on stage, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Sanjeeva Jai Singh, the Acting Director of Physical Education. The first set of awards will be for representing Sri Lanka University team in the 53rd Senior National Basketball Championship 2022, awarded to LVW Fembeck. <laughs> SI Ube Vikrama. <laughs> and DSN Ferdinando. For representing Sri Lanka University team in Senior National Hockey Men's Championship 2022, ladies and gentlemen, we have PDH Rantana. TPS Sashinta.
WND Herat. And finally, we have RTBDNA Shanta. So please remain on stage to receive your special token of appreciation from Acting Director of Physical Education. Thank you very much. And to award the next set of awards, let me invite Dr. Pratibha Manhame Eva, the Rector of the Sri Pali Campus of the University of Kalambu, and he will be accompanied by Mr. Nayanti Chandrasena, the Instructor in Physical Education. So ladies and gentlemen, a very humble request to join your hands for a very big round of applause to our very own athletes as they have been bringing the name of our alma mater to greater heights. So please join with me to give your very big round of applause to them. So let me continue with the awarding in the international, sorry, in the national sphere. For representing Sri Lanka University team in Junior Premier League Basketball Championship Level 2 in 2022. LBW Femback. TM Katagoda and UT Andrews representing Sri Lanka University team in Asian Union. Asian Oceania University Chess Championship AUCC 2022. We have DGMS Duluvira. And RMS Bandara. In the recently concluded Inter-University Championship 2022, ladies and gentlemen, the University of Colombo has been performing in all the spheres of sports and bringing honor to our alma mater. And next, we'll be awarding championship trophies to the runners-up of the teams. Teams who have won runners-up place in the respective sports. And I invite the team captains of the sports to come forward to receive your championship trophy. Starting off with badminton women. Ladies and gentlemen, please give a very big round of applause to our wonderful teams because they have been representing our alma mater in the inter-university platform to bringing honor. Next, we have Chess Women. Football Men. We have netball. Roving women. Swimming women. Tennis men. And finally, tennis women.
So please remain on stage to receive a special token of appreciation from our Thank you, sir and madam. We now move on to another special set of awards. To present that, I invite Dr. Kapila Bandara, Chairman, Sports Advisory Board, University of Colombo, Dean, Faculty of Education, University of Colombo. He will be accompanied by Mr. Ajanta Dahanayaka, Instructor in Physical Education. Ladies and gentlemen, join your hands together. We now felicitate the past club members of the Amalgamated Club for the year 2021. The President, Mr. Mahin De Silva. Vice President Malinta Vijayvira and Nadhani Mendis. The Junior Treasurer Dumindu Mutukumarage. Next, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to felicitate the media units of the University of Colombo for their service in bringing out and reaching out the sports at the university to an international and national platform. So first we have the FOSS Media from the Faculty of Science, University of Colombo. Next we have FMF Media from the Faculty of Management and Finance. I invite Mr. Sanjana Vandikasekara to receive that award. And the Colombo Beacon. Well, Next, we are going to award for the University of Colombo representations in the national level, the national sports level in the year 2022. In the recently concluded FFSL President Gold Cup Football Championship 2022, the University of Colombo men's football team emerged as runner-up. So I invite the team captain to receive this championship trophy on behalf of his entire team. In the recently concluded 53rd Senior National Basketball Championship 2022 Level 2, the team has emerged as champions and we have two representations from our very own University of Colombo. So please join with me to welcome S.I. Ubeya Vikrama. And D.S.N. Ferdinando. The Taekwondo team of the University of Colombo was able to brilliantly perform in the Korean Ambassador's Cup Taekwondo Championship 2022. The following are the representatives of the University of Colombo Taekwondo team. AP Benedict. HMRN Madhuanta. HTSJ Madhushankar. H A A U Geetma V Kirtana
and W. M. U. Fernando. In the 37th National Rowing Championship 2022, the University of Colombo rowing team was able to secure a silver medal in the Cox 4 event in the intermediate category. The respective team members are as follows. J.S. Cruz, P.H.G.P. Kulatilaka, BMF Fernando PVAB Pereira LMSN Waniga Sekara And also ladies and gentlemen As I was saying, as the sorry, in the recently concluded National Palathletic Championship 2022, we were able to secure a silver medal in 400 meters B1 category. Please give a huge of huge round of applause to W A N A Vijay Singh. Her. Ladies and gentlemen, now we present the awards for the individuals who represented Sri Lanka national team at international level in the year 2022. The South Women's Football Championship 2022, RMPA Rajapaksha. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for these individuals who represented the Sri Lanka national team at international level at the third T20 Blind Cricket World Cup. AMSD Karunaratna. T. Yogaraj. In the year 2022, we were able to secure, secure a place in the 50-meter breaststroke with a record of 40.31 seconds and the 100-meter breaststroke with 1.27 minutes. Swimming women, Elsie and Fernando. For a period of more than 10 consecutive days, all the faculties of University of Colombo fought against one championship. We now move on to presenting awards for the Interfaculty Freshers Overall Championships 2022. Women's Overall Championship, Faculty of Management and Finance.
the men's overall champions faculty of science the overall second runners up faculty of science The overall runners up of the interfaculty freshers overall champions UCSC And now the overall champions of the Interfaculty Freshers Championship, Faculty of Management and Finance. Sir, I kindly request you to remain on stage. And now to present this award, I invite the Vice President David De Silva and the Vice President Imal Shah Bayevikrama of the Amalgamated Club. Thank you, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a privilege for all of us to be in the presence of someone who we consider as a hero. This is a small presentation about our guest of honor. General Daya Ratnaika was the 20th commander of the Sri Lanka Army with a distinguished career record of more than 35 years. He was also the former secretary to the Ministry of Industries and former chairman of the Sri Lanka Ports Authority. He was enlisted to the regular force of the Sri Lanka Army on 6 February 1980 as an officer cadet and upon commissioning, he followed a number of military and non-military training and academic courses, including junior command and senior command courses in India, governance and management of defense course at Cranfield University, UK, higher level security studies diploma course and advanced communication skills course in Asia Pacific Center for Security Studies in Honolulu, Hawaii, USA. He also graduated from Defence Service Command and Staff College, Bangladesh, National Defence University, China, and Army Intelligence Schools, Fort Hanchuka, Arizona, USA. Currently, he is reading for his PhD at General Sir John Kotalavala Defence University. General Dhar Ratnayaka has held many command appointments to suit his rank and his role as the Commissioner General of Rehabilitation to rehabilitate 14,500 more LTTE ex-combatants has been widely acknowledged. His exceptionally unique performances 
in many daunting military operations have been well recognized as a battlefield veteran and decorated with more than 26 gallantry and service medals. We are honored to have General Dharat Naika as the guest of honor at the Champions Night 2022. General Daya Ratnaika was the 20th commander of... Ladies and gentlemen, I consider this as an absolute honor to invite this great individual on stage. General Daya Ratnaika, the floor is yours to address. Hi everyone, good evening ladies and gentlemen, Vice Chancellor Colombo University, my good friend Professor H.G. <coughs> Karunathna and all other senior uh, faculty deans and other senior officials of the Colombo University and dear children, students and those who won colors and various awards today. And it's a great privilege for me to stand here in front of you, ladies and dear children, especially, because it's a great privilege. And thank you very much for that uh, nice introduction. And uh, first thing I must tell you, Professor, that uh, the image of a student, of a university student, was completely changed of mine today. Because my image of a student, university student, or the students that we see on a daily basis in the TV going and getting hammered by the military and the army and the police and all that. That's the kind of unit student I wanted to see today. I told Professor also when I <laughs> came here. But today you change that impression of mine. Uh, or this should be highlighted. This should be your brand, uni student, university students that I have seen in my days. First time I came to the university in 1969, Professor, as a very small boy, when my eldest sister came to Kalani University. I came with her. Since then, I had uh, four other sisters, uh, two si si sisters and a brother and four of them. And all came to university, I came to the university. That's, I came to the university only with them only. I never <laughs> came to the university, I ran other way and I joined the military. So <clears throat> here, when I came here, actually the first thing at the outset I must tell you, uh, Professor, here <clears throat> we must highlight, I saw the media unit, I saw various faculties and all these children are quite uh, capable of handling social media. You must get into social media and change the image of a university and you should show yourself as a student of the university. If I could see, then I was telling the Professor, it was like a military uh, colors night. All the recipients were coming on stage, smartly dressed, nicely walking, straight, chest straight in front and the tummy behind. Uh, it is other way around for the most of the students nowadays. And they see some like Eluagit Kodakwe Mehmadagan and Moon Lake Andulakne, Bade, Badevalakne, Avila Jati Ale Katakarno, Humbada Gandhi Hitin, Hemai. I'm sorry, the words. I'm being a soldier, so let me use some soldier words. So, <clears throat> and but if I bring the image of a university by showing you into the society, the image of a university student in the society also will be definitely changed. It should be a paradigm shift. This shift you got to make. And the image, once again, I am repeating, you got to change. That's my first request. And it's a great privilege for me to come here today in this evening. And once again, I thank uh, Professor Karunanathna and the other organizing staff for giving me this opportunity. And I have got this kind of opportunity. I have been to Peradin University uh, and few other universities in, in uh, uh, occasions like this. I have seen many students, many, many universities basically have. This has basically in the past, when we were students, when we were sports, uh, uh, when we were school, uh, when we were schooling, when we were doing sports in our era, 
a lot of junior students came together with us and they were doing sports. Since um, of late, it uh, got faded away basically in the international and or the national level. Very rarely we see a uh, university students nowadays. So if you continue, Columbia University take the lead. I was told by professor, you have 41,000 students in the university. If you get together and do that, you can change the image. You must fight in the fields of sports. You must fight against the military if you can. So we, we dominate the entire sports uh, at national and international level. Sri Lanka bought two Olympic medals uh, and uh, three uh, para uh, Olympic medals, all five brought by military army people. Duncan White, a military lieutenant from my own regiment, Susantika Jaisinga, uh, army girl, and all others, of course, para <coughs> Olympic Olympians, they are all from the military. So last time, uh, SAF Games, we won uh, nearly uh, 400, uh, nearly 380 or 90 uh, medals, 80% from the army, military. We, why we do that? We make it as a fashion. In my case, I, I uh, as a schoolboy, sports was our fashion. Because when we set uh, targets, I wanted to be in a military office, army office. I wanted to join the army. So when initially, when young stage, we, um, okay, we thought, uh, I was uh, asking other people, I never had my relations in the military. So I wanted to join the army, and the, I mean the military. So they said, okay, you must be a good sportsman, you must have a character, you must have leadership, you must have this, then, that, all. So I uh, listed them out. I, uh, I mean, got it as a fashion. The sports was my fashion. Leadership was my fashion. Developing, uh, I mean, uh, helping others was my fashion. So we developed it like that. So at the end, so I became a national champion. For five consecutive years, I was 400 meter champion. So likewise, the first day, I must tell you, uh, dear children, when I came, I am from Kurunayagala, Malia Deva. So the first time I came to Colombo to represent an uh, uh, athletic event, way back, um, I don't know the year, but I was under 12. I was running under 12. That was my first time. There were <coughs> about uh, 13, 14 students who came. So while coming, the teacher, I mean, they nominate a teacher to come with the team and not the right uh, 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 sports in charge of the school, but there's a teacher. And that teacher <coughs> sat near me. Teacher was asking him, Mama sir, he was telling me, I was 12 years. So I was under the impression that the children in Colombo must be Yoda Patao. Those days we were thinking, uh, I mean, physical size of the Ganankara in Loku size, Mamat Panti Ganankara in the Mamata Usama Inza, Eka Lehima. I think Mama make a single link here now. Mama, no, Duanda. Duanda Villa, maybe no, then cut a long story short. In no, Mam Balagana, running suit again, the Nisalam, he went under twelve. In no, Duanda Villa, Mam Belwakome, Yoda Patakila, Ekale, Darwani, Apathy Bunna, Walraka, social media. We had only Mira Patre, Mira Patre, last page was the Yodea story. Paka Mugad de Gagan, Mame Chitrakata, Professor Kotiba, Etogota Eka. Tama Ape, Eke in the Viriata, Yoda Tama, Eke Patau, Yoda Patau, I think Apit imitate Karanha than Neatama. It would Apit Mama Hitagana, then me, Yoda Patau, what they in Balagana Duan. Mama Gila then in a Saracen, Kinoga, Beluaco, Yoda Patau Neni. Mama Hitana may put a mind decatur. Mama Hitana may in the me, Mukunda me, may may watch any Magadang in a watch neck. May in the Meso people, Hal Mesog is at ten among. Munda Pardin Mugat, Mamadu Nogil, put a Palavinia, Duola. Our teacher Duog Nevila Maus Saganagia. Yeah, have a dash it, Adonagan, Devonia Villane. That Egatama made me creed having gun a fashion again. Kavada, Probagran Neno, Vijay Vireno, Catino, Patagandino, 
have a ekatik address with ne apitamin no that is the level that is what you get from your sports when you do extra curricular activities not only sports all other that make you a perfect person because why i have heard professors you must uh, pardon me if i make a mistake here <coughs> i have heard when you are when we are grooming a child we groom based on four fundamentals those four fundamentals first thing the uh, fundamental pillars first pillar is the parental pillar parent pillar what you get the the uh, the shakti you get the energy you get from your parents what you get is the first pillar it becomes the first pillar parents and your relations and what you bring from samsara and all what you that's going to be parents parental pillar the second pillar is the knowledge pillar that you get from the classroom school and from the environment and the society and all that then the third pillar is what you get from your religion whatever is the values value pillar third pillar these three pillars no value if you don't know how to manage it like the management uh, faculty or uh, faculty uh, one all the uh, top sin professor was uh, telling me what does my this thing my thing, and very good i am happy so management so you don't know how to manage it if you don't know uh, if you don't know how to manage it no value of having these three pillars hungak vela ota ada tiyenne me three wheel tama ape society ekata enni three wheel ara hatare ni pillar ekak nathuwa nondi kakula habang kakula kila api kiyanne so etakota me the fourth pillar is the pillar that you develop from your extra curricular activities then there you get how to win how to there when you have this everyone is enjoying here all having a smile none of these faces moon ra guti kanda thiyena moonu neme ara dakkama hombata ganda hitana moonu neme honda honda lassana moonu girls are very beautiful kollu tika bamuru wage idi mehema hadenne mehema kollanda samaje yana kota aye kellange aduwak thiyena vidiyan ne මෙහෙම ගෑන් ළමින්ට කොල්ලන්ගේ අඩුවක් තියෙන විදියක් නැහැ හියුජ් ඩිමාන්ඩයක් ඇති මේ 41000 ස්ටුඩන්ට්ස් හොඳ ඩිමාන්ඩයක් ඇති සෝ එමයි පපු ඉස්සරහට දාලා යන අයට දැන් ඉන්න මේ ඔය කොරවක් වගේ මෙහෙම ඇවිදින එවුන් වැස්සට කෝච්චියට අහුවෙච්ච පොල්ලිලි වගේ සමහරයි එහෙම නෙමෙයි මේ තරුණයෝ තමයි අපට ඕනේ නේ සොසයිටි එක we need people like you this country needs people like you that is why so you must be full fledged children when you walk into the i mean young people when you walk into the larger society so if we can have all the university university students coming into the society like you people this country will be a different country altogether this is what we need it is not only just uh, winning a thing that create you organizing event like this the boys who organized spoke to me uh, and um, it's very good the way he spoke the way he mannerism the punctuality all that excellent this is what we need enisa api society ke hitagane inne university students job ekata enda bidiyak ne meke thiyena loke rate thiyena lokuma investment ekak dala students atika hadala university ekata enna kota they are the best in the country at the time you are entering the university is the best in the country but when you come out to jam level samara kavrud ganan ganne kisima rajya ayathanakata ganne ne kisima private sector ekata ganne ne kisima tanakata ganne ne i have own my experience some when some time back when i was a director at the army headquarters there were 100 students 150 or students the university scream making aava apata hamudawata ganne kiyala keling hita ganne ba ek kenukuta එහෙම බෑ ඊට පස්සේ අන්තිමට 10 දිනයි ඉතුරුනේ අනිත් ඔක්කොම ගියා යන්න ඉන්න බෑ ඊට පස්සේ ඒ 10 දිනත් පස්සේ අපි වෙන තැන් වල ජොබ් හොයලා දුන්නා කාටවත් හරි ගියේ නැහැ something radically wrong ඒක it is not the fault of the students fault of the system fault of the system so මේ සිස්ටම් එක වෙනස් කරන්න නම් අපට අවශ්‍ය මේකයි i request kalamu university to take the lead and i am very happy that kalambo university has become the champion otherwise last time i went uh, about few years back the uh, the morato university won and similarly i went for their night also like this and uh, uh, mr ratna is there and he is the one who invited me so 
and um, few years back I was speaking to them, uh, them same. So <coughs> without any further ado, and when I came here in the morning, uh, in the evening, when we were having a chat with professor and all that, <laughs> okay. uh, Malka, my ever, sir, may me, Tam, with Tarunia again, my ever retire at the gill. And then, sir, retire at the gill. Then retire and eat the gill. Manka, we look at the grand bar, retire another, may Tarno is. Am I? It is a happy expiry date, pendant killing in sports in Satama. Tama, objective, if someone is coming to attack you, Gand Bernam, Elila Botuari Haponogina, Adistan in. Am in the Pulong in the Monod? Sports again in a Shakti. What you get. So you children, when you come out and I am talking, now you a whole life I can just tell you. If, if I interview one or two people here, I can tell you after 50 years you will be like this. After 30 years, because I have gone past the entire thing. I started like you and reached this level. Similarly, you people, uh, when you come into this sports, the level of sports going up, the brand name of sports going up, the brand name of the university going up, Brand name of the uni student is going up when you all do that. The, the other performance here, uh, the young boy who performed, your ambassador, sports ambassador. We must highlight these things in the society. In, we must highlight them in the media. Then other dancing, all. It's a huge, it's a reflection of the entire country life. All the elements are here. Culture, uh, sports, the various things, science, all that. Everything is here. It's a reflection of the country. So 41,000 students, a huge student community. If you can get together and we can transform the entire country. We can get rid of all these third class politicians. That should be the Aragale. You can make a huge Aragale. If you do that, our support will be 100% with you. Because we need people like you to take the leadership of this country. That is what we have sacrificed for. We have sacrificed all that. Maranetu Vedla, Hatarabala Kaila, Haikarla, Tamatin, Ude Gila, Arekani Kaila, Hunter Massage Kerla, Killing Kerinetam, Yanda Bedasuna Hatrake Kerinet. That is the level we are. We have sacrificed so much. We have 10,000 soldiers without limbs. We have more than 1,500 soldiers like vegetable logi. Nikanguhin and they they have sacrificed so much. We have 34,000 disabled. We have 29,000 sacrificed. Prana dhani dunna obovinvi. Edila dhamma api saame gane latini. Me saame adha eke ekana, eke eke thangu alta ginnila rata nati karla bankolat karna tatte de patte latino. So make it a, who should take the leadership? It is not the soldier. It is the academic community. The intellectual community must take the leadership. Since you are not taking the leadership, the leader, the flag bearer of the country, soldier has become the flag bearer of the country. Soldier 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 individual so it should not be the firm. You must take the leadership. Military is good for something else. Military, if there is a problem, we come and fix it. When the University of Colombo had a serious problem to get it clear, clear I mean, cleaning and all, some other problem, there was the management faculty, the toilet take a block, out of the out of the Professor, I Sorry, sorry, not to run you down, 
but I am <laughs> so when 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 you say Madhuru ke logan ne peru naar royal ne ka petre thi na kaanu hai vatro peru na hamda ham bang hai wo hamen ek kaam ki la bala karand pulaand ek karand bhai lo koo prashna thi na kyo apik hi lamme suma davas dekhen karla dum hamda when you can't solve an issue you tell us we know how to fix it uh, because hamda hai inne logo ka kam meliyo I think we find an easy way of doing things so any sa me. There's a saying, no. If you have a difficult task, give it to a lazy man. He will find an easy way of doing things. That is how we do. We use, use, see the easiest way of doing it and do it. Management faculty ke kata kato pata kya hai? Fifteen years. <laughs> Fifteen years they couldn't pump it out, and it ape hamuda ave katte kabe karna gawna central bank in ne isra aur okkom karna STF ka nirman karna okkom ek gandai. Aur ya maru inde gila. Dawasak. Um, Secretary Defence Secretary Anand Kumar called the complaint. Kerala. Then he came and told me, "Daya, can you go and uh, sort that out?" Then I came to see Professor Hiru Murugam uh, was the Vice Chancellor. She uh, nice, uh, good lady. I came and spoke to her. <coughs> We knew each other. Then I went there and right, I went. I <coughs> asked the problem. Mukad the prashni. Me, be. Apat make a current tieno. Me, me. Ape make a storage system. Me ka tieno. ए सिस्टम में कहती है न्यूडिंग में वाला तीन नहीं जाती ऐसा में किलोमीटर के हाथ गिनियां डोंग है तो ये मेक लिंक कराने यानी सा आप टाइम वाले 15 मिलियन तम हम दाम वैदिम ऐसे क्या ने मेक टो ने 40 मिलियन इतने यानी सा आप टाइम का उदाहरण में गैप पे की पुराने बे सो इट इस रिमेनिंग दैट वाज़ द प्रॉब्लम We agreed 20 million. I went and told uh, my team, sent it. They went and uh, <coughs> they um, uh, came here and uh, they uh, gave me the plan. <coughs> Only uh, two million. Abi kaha dhan two million, professor? Are two million ye? Abi two million, abi 20 million gatta. Kaman nai ni? It was say. Abi problem me sort out kar. Abi logo te hi tu nai. Are logo te. इगन गत्ता है लोगों को ठीक दरों ने आप ही एवं आप ही के लिए शॉर्टस काटते के बैलुआ बाला लापी बैलुआ कहो मदर मेक अतिन्द्र दान में तो नतीना मेहम या ना मैं मकाद आरे लोगों बाटे मेक है भाई मेह बाटे मेह बाटे समापात वेला मेक फ्लोए का यान दयाने किलोमीटर के कामारा के हैं आप ही बैलुआ ने आप ही क अपर टू मिलियन है, फाइव मिलियन इधर गया, टू एंड हाफ मिलियन तो कोई तो पंप है, दम माही कर रहा, ताऊ में वैरी करने के दरने मंदर ने एक, एक लाइफटाइम गारंटी, एक अपम करना थे, ये तो वैसे अभी ताऊ हम दाई नहीं, ट्वेंटी मिलियन हम बेचते कि फाइव मिलियन वेज अंकर ला, फिफ्टी मिलियन लाभ ऐतिहा� इतने ऐसा मामे एक विहिलो टेक हुए एक ने भी मांग किया ने माय पॉइंट टुडे इस दे व्हाट यू डिड टुडे एंड वंस अगेन आई विल नॉट टेक टू मच टाइम थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर गिविंग मी दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी आई एम वेरी हैप्पी फ्रॉम द टाइम दैट आई केम आई रियली एंजॉयड दिस इवनिंग and I am looking forward to see these children going and doing very well in the society. Definitely you are going to do. And um, today, the winners, congratulations, all of you. And uh, you are the strength of our country. You are the pillar of our country. You are the future of our country. And I wish you all the best. And especially, <laughs> Professor and the crowd, I wish all of you good luck, Professor. Thank you so much. All the best to all of you. Good night. Thank you very much, Sophia Awards, and please remain on stage to award the next set of awards. And our chief our guest of honor today will be accompanied by Mr. Sanjeev Chaya Singh, the Director of Physical Education. Well, now, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to award the best players from the respective sports for the year 2022 who have brought honor to our alma mater. And let's see who will be awarded with these awards in their respective sports. First, in track and field, the best athlete of the University of Columbia 2022 men, SKR Vaduarachi.
the best athlete, UT Andrews. Next we have, in badminton, the best player means C.S. Ile Perumarachi. And the best player women, we have A.P. Samaranayaka. Next in baseball, the best player, B.S. Senaratma. Best player basketball men's WDD Hoy. Best player basketball women TM Katagoda. In Karam, the best player men, BHM Vijayatunga. And next in chess, the best player men, DGMS Doluvira. And the best player women, D. S. Pereira. Next in men's cricket, we had the best batsman in the year 2022, V. Jatushan. The best bowler, MPP Sachinta. The best fielder, GGPC Bandara. And on a notice, ladies and gentlemen, this player is not currently in Sri Lanka as he's attending an international tournament. As on behalf of him, the captain of the team will be receiving his award. And next, the best all-rounder in cricket, M.A.R. Senaviratna. And next in L.A., the best player men's in 2022, S.S. Dahanayaka. And in LA, the best player women, A. Bimasha Shamali. Football, best player. Football, best player, WMS Vijay Singha. Hockey, best player men, PDA Chirantana. Best player women, HN Vidana Patirana.
Karate Best Player Men, SDK Vikramasinghe. Karate Best Player Woman, YADS Supunsara. Netball best player BAS sets Balasuria. Road race best runner HKE Mendes. Ladies and gentlemen, next is roving the best oarsman, J.S. Cruz. The best oarswoman, G. Sridharan. Ladies and gentlemen in rugby, the Ruggerite of the year, DSPAUM Pires. The best swimmer, men, H.A.K. Aranda. Best swimmer, women, L.C.N. Fernando. Table tennis, best player men, ST Palihavadana. Table tennis, best player woman, KS Udayangi. The best player men of Taekwondo, HMRN Madhuanta. Best player women, Taekwondo, WMU Fernando. The men's best player in tennis, Emil Hetiheva. The best player women's in tennis, DC Pereira. Men's best player in volleyball, AABW Amarakorn.
the women's best player of volleyball, E. D. J. Chaturya. The best lifter of weightlifting, P. M. Malavana. The best wrestler of wrestling, B.H.J. Helmala. The best athlete, Min, S.K.R. Vaduarachi. So please remain on stage to receive our special token of appreciation by our president, Harit Lukugamage, and secretary, Sachin Bala Surya, of the Amalgamated Club of the University of Colombo. Thank you, sirs. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are now moving on with the final entertainment performance tonight. To be more specific on this performance, ladies and gentlemen, this will be a melodious musical performance by our very own Mr. Dinul Fernando, the weightlifting captain of the University of Colombo in the year 2022 and also an undergraduate from the Faculty of Management and Finance. So please join with me to welcome Mr. Dinul Fernando on stage. Check one, just one, check. When your legs don't work like they used to before And I can't sweep you off of your feet Will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Will your eyes still smile from your cheeks? And darling, I will be loving you Till we're 17 mm, yeah. And baby my heart Still for less Heart at 23 I'm thinking about How people fall in love 
up in mysterious ways Maybe it's all part of a plan Me, I fall in love with you every single day I just want to tell you I am Let's get it on Let's love, baby. Let's get it on, sugar. Let's get it on. All right, the ones who know, do sing along. Laya pura tuai alingane, magi patum mohe vashi pune. Kan peti di ke rasamantare Ita umatu kalava ke Sing Hangala koheti am the vehane Mahagum kada hale Kohe anadama Oya te sindan midila Kise anadama Oya te sinen vila Ata me vindi na sine Me sima Nura kine yai alu vila Kohe yana da ma Oya te sinen midila Kise yana da ma Oya te sinen vila All right, the ones who know this song, please do sing along. Kati ma dhanna me sindu matte kam kiyo. Ahinamma ino hita esande adila. Sahinamma mubage aspura radila Thani thaledi thani va urga raganan balala Ave lavaka payu tawi pabalum hinda Thani atha se hitin hitapu malviye arume Numba nisa ven ni be pirunu Alayin Vendune Jaya te paya na poda sandha Ita vene na pini dureka Ita hara na me maduka Sepa se vinda Ita rave la eli vena sandha Ita hara na ma paluwa Sahinamma 
nu pagi es purar dila thank you Ladies and gentlemen, give it up once again for our very own Dinul Fernando. Senior Professor H.D. Karnaratna is the current Vice-Chancellor of the University of Colombo, is also a Director at the University of Tokyo, Sri Lanka office since 2019. He is a member of the Dean's Advisory Committee, Faculty of Humanities and Social Science, University of Sri Jawadhanapura, during the period of 2020-2021. He was a senior professor of Faculty of Management and Finance and also a former dean of the Faculty of Management and Finance, University of Colombo. Further, Professor has also served as the president of the Japanese Graduates Alumni Association of Sri Lanka and chairman of the Sports Board. Senior Professor H.D. Karnaratna is a sports enthusiast who always extends his support to athletes to achieve greater heights. We are honored to have the Vice Chancellor, Senior Professor H.D. Karnaratna as the chief guest of the Champions Night 2022. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time to hear from our esteemed chief guest for the evening, Senior Professor H.D. Karnaratna, and we are honored to have him grace us with his presence tonight. Let us all welcome him. Very good evening to all. The General Dayaratnaika, former chairman of the Sports Council of Sri Lanka and former chairman of the Sri Lanka Athletic Association and 20th commander of the Sri Lanka Army. So General Dharat Naik, of course, we know that he's a colorsman five times continuously in Sri Lanka athletics. So today we invited him. Thank you very much for joining with us in this uh, talent evening and all deans of the faculties, directors, uh, registrar, Berza, all administrative officers, my dear students, it gives me great pleasure and honor to address you in this very proud day that you have brought the University of Colombo into a highest level in year 2022 as well. I can remember the story what General Dharat Naik was telling, that was in 2011, when I was the Dean of the Faculty of Management and Finance, and uh, of course they helped a lot to our faculty as well. But the most important thing, the 2023, I believe that we will win again the first place in the inter-university inter tournaments. For that, we are doing our level best. I know that all the amalgamated club captains, members, you did marvelous job during the year 2022. Particularly, I should thank the chairman of the sports board, Dr. Kapila Bandara. He always working hard to keep the sports up in the University of Colombo. And acting director, Sanjeeva, all the time uh, in the university and helping you more and more. 
Not only that, of course, all instructors and all coaches in the University of Colombo sports teams, they are doing their level best. I know that you all have won uh, a very difficult battle because we know in the universities now, we have the sports specialists. There are three universities. They run sports science degree programs, and they hire, they take the national uh, champions for their degree programs. But in the University of Colombo, all of you are doing sports as extracurricular activity. That is, the, that is the best thing I can tell you. While you are specializing your uh, uh, own specialty, you have done sport as extracurricular activity, then you could beat all these sport sciences, sport uh, specialists as well. So it is a great privilege for the University of Colombo. We believe that we will keep continuously uh, this uh, in uh, years also coming. And I should thank all the people who help and you organizing this activity. Particularly, I should thank Professor, Senior Professor Vajira Rizanayaka, who uh, helped us to uh, get this audience and sub give, uh, giving support for uh, this event. Uh, especially, you know, the Faculty of Medicine. Uh, of course, there are a couple of uh, uh, players and team leaders, team uh, even captains from fac Faculty of Medicine. And this year, uh, President of the Amalgamated Club also elected from the Faculty of Medicine. So all faculties, we have now 10 faculties. All faculties should get together for winning 2023. So that is we need to consider. But on the other hand, in fact, in the morning, I met one Mr. Prabhat Patabendi. He was the captain of Amalgamated Club in 1980 in the University of Colombo. I asked him, well, what, are, what is he doing? He's a business owner in Canada. He has registered many businesses in Canada. But you see how the sportsmen have gone into a doing business in foreign countries, and he's well uh, uh, qualified and well uh, wealthy person in Canada. So this is what you can say. There are many, many students who graduated from University of Colombo because they did extracurricular activities, they can achieve many other countries also as a talented person. So I don't want to tell you what the importance of sports. You have shown it to the, all the students in University of Colombo. We have 16,000 undergraduate students and 11,000 postgraduate students and uh, altogether 41,000 learning partners in University of Colombo. In future, we believe that the sport should be one area where we need to promote more and more students engaging in sports by organizing maybe a special sport day for the University of Colombo as everyone to participate, not only uh, competing and uh, developing the uh, professional skills, but also to get participation from more students uh, for sport activities. I think uh, in this line, uh, the Department of Physical Education, they are doing very well. I should thank all the time this Physical Education Department uh, and all former directors uh, and, uh, of course, all uh, instructors and coaches. Anyway, that we can understand how the University of Colombo students are performing uh, when we come to this kind of uh, evening. So we are proud of you. Do your best. As Professor Dairat Naika said that you are real hero of University of Colombo. Thank you very much for organizing this event and inviting me. Thank you very much, sir, for those kind words. And please remain on stage for the next presentation of awards. Ladies and gentlemen, now we move on to awarding of a special set of awards. This will be awarded by Senior Professor H.D. Karna Ratna, the Vice Chancellor, University of Colombo. And he will be accompanied by Dr. Kapila Bandar, Chairman of the Sports Advisory Board, and Mr. Sanjeeva Jayasinghe, 
acting director of the department of physical education as i said before we present these awards to a special set of individuals who are behind the overall success of sports in university of colombo felicitation of the instructors in physical education and director of physical education mr kavindu abey singh her Mrs. Siresha Madhuwanti Mr. Samir Madhushankar Mr Anusha De Silva Mr Sujan Valgampaya Mr Ajanta Dahanayaka Miss Nayanti Chandrasena Mrs Vasanta Ratnayaka Mr Kavindu Abe Singh Before we move on to presenting the award for this individual let's take a look at this video Mr Sanjeeva Jai Singh is the acting director of the Department of Physical Education and also a cricket coach. He is a dedicated and passionate sports enthusiast with a strong passion towards improving the sports facilities and opportunities available for students at the university. As a skilled and experienced personality who is dedicated to efficiently managing all aspects of sports administration including coordinating events and ensuring that all athletes have the resources required to successfully conduct the sports functions Mr Sanjeev Jai Singh is always committed to promote a culture of sportsmanship teamwork and healthy competition among undergraduates while seeking the parts to inspire and engage undergraduates in sports activities and this award goes to the acting director of physical education mr sanjeev jaya singh Ladies and gentlemen, we have reached towards the pinnacle of the Colors Night 2022. Next, we are awarding two special awards and championships for the winners of the Inter University Championship in 2022. The McGogie Challenge Trophy, donated by Professor C. A. McGogie for the Inter University Champions in Hockey Men, awarded to the men's hockey team of the University of Colombo.
The Stanley Vijay Sundara Challenge Trophy donated by Professor Stanley Vijay Sundara for the Inter University Champion in Robbing Men's goes to none other than the Robbing Crew of the University of Colombo. The Pereira Challenge Trophy donated by Mr. and Mrs. G.D.D. Pereira for the Inter-University Champions in Table Tennis Women goes to the Table Tennis Women's team of the University of Colombo. The Abherat Nabandara Challenge Trophy donated by Professor W.M. Abherat Nabandara for the Inter-Universal Champions in Taekwondo. It goes to none other than the men's Taekwondo team of the University of Colombo. Ladies and gentlemen, we have arrived at the most awaited moment of the evening. The moment where we will witness the greatest amongst the best. Ladies and gentlemen, brace yourself for the awarding ceremony of the most outstanding awards. First, out of more than 25 men's sports team in the University of Colombo, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. ALD Munamale Challenge Cup for the most outstanding men's team of the year 2022 awarded to <music> Jointly awarded to Taekwondo Men's Pumsai Team and Drawing Men's Cox 4 Crew Ladies and gentlemen, these are the joint winners of the outstanding men's team of the University of Colombo for the year 2022. Well, next, we are going to award for the most outstanding women's team. Any guesses, ladies and gentlemen, tonight? Who will be awarded at the most outstanding women's team? Okay, let's see. Professor D.A. Ranasinghe Challenge Cup for the most outstanding women's team of the University of Colombo for the year 2022, awarded to... Ladies and gentlemen, the table tennis women's team at the University of Colombo. Ladies and gentlemen, next we move on to Mr. Chintaka Jayawardana Memorial Trophy presented by Mr. Lakshman Vijay Surya for the sportsmen winning the most number of colors. Ladies and gentlemen, this award is not awarded this year. Moving on to the Professor Stanley Vijay Sundara Memorial Trophy.
Ladies and gentlemen, moving on to the Professor Stanley Vijay Sundar Memorial Trophy for the sportswoman winning the most number of colors. Let's look at the nominees. It is jointly awarded to Umesha Andrews, Faculty of Science, and Dilani Pereira, Faculty of Management and Finance. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the next award is the most prestigious award that a sportsman of our alma mater can win in this year. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to award for the most outstanding sportsman of the year. Out of many individuals who have sacrificed their time, dedication, effort in bringing glory and honor to our alma mater, University of Colombo is proud to award Mr. S.T. Valpeter Challenge Cup for the most outstanding sportsman of the year, 2022. And before that, let's take a look at the nominees. Three sports, three spectacular sportsmen. We have HMR and Madhuvanta from Taekwondo, PM Malavana from weightlifting, PDH Rantana from hockey. Any guesses? <laughs> Mr. S.T. Vaupita Challenge Cup for the most outstanding sportsman of the year, 2022, awarded to. The Citation. Having won the Cookie Won Cup, Korean Ambassadors Cup 2022, Senior Under 30 Pumsai Event Gold Medal, 47th National Sports Festival, Western Province Silver Medal, Inter University Games, Individual Pumsai Blue and Below Category Bronze Medal, Individual Sparring Bantam Weight Medal, Gold Medal, and Team Pumsai Silver Medal, Mr. S.T. Valpita Challenge Cup for the most outstanding sportsman of the year, Ravino Madhuvanta from the Faculty of Science. Ladies and gentlemen, the time has arrived for us to witness who amongst these sportswomen will be coronated as the most outstanding sportswoman for the year 2022. So ladies and gentlemen, these are your nominees.
Mr. Leslie Hanungate Challenge Cup for the most outstanding sportswoman is a title that a sportswoman can receive in the University of Colombo for the days of hard work, commitment, dedication, and sacrifice. And as you all saw, we have MRGP Navela, UT Andrews, and RMPA Rajapaksha. Ladies and gentlemen, whom do you think the winner is? Seems like it's a hard guess. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the Mr. Leslie Hanungate Challenge Cup for the most outstanding sportswoman of the year. These are her citations. She represented the senior national women's football team in 2022 first AAF tournament in Nepal. And she's a champion of provincial football tournament in National Sports Festival. And she is nominated SLUSA Special Awards. This is none other than Parami Rajapaksha. Ladies and gentlemen, please give a huge, of, huge round of applause for this amazing sportswoman. For the first time in history, ladies and gentlemen, 16 state universities fought for the ultimate inter-university championship in the year 2022. For more than three months, in various venues and various locations all around the Sri Lanka, these teams have fought to bring honor to their respective alma mater. So at the end of a hard battle, ladies and gentlemen, we are proud to say the men's overall champions of the Inter-University Championship 2022, none other than the University of Colombo. <laughs> All the individual points that y'all have taken in your respective sports, ladies and gentlemen, have finally added up to bring the Inter-University Men's Overall Championship to our alma mater. Day by day, I personally saw how the points table was intense. With the top three universities securing the position time to time, it was a hard fought battle at the end. Ladies and gentlemen, at the Inter University Championship 2022, University of Colombo was the overall runners up. With a margin of very small points, only second to the University of Sri Jayawardenepura, University of Colombo was able to win the overall runners up place at the Inter University Championship 2022 and it was all your hard work, commitment and dedication ladies and gentlemen which brought frame to our alma mater. So please remain on stage to receive your special token of appreciation by the President Harit Lukugamage and Secretary Sajini Balasuri of the Amalgamated Club. Thank you, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, we have now arrived at the last few minutes of this glamorous night. So before we conclude the evening's proceedings, it's my pleasure to invite Ms. Sajini Balasuria, the secretary of the Amalgamated Club, to deliver the vote of thanks.
Robert Hayes once said, if you can't win a race, make sure the person ahead of you breaks the record. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight I stand before you as the 2022 Colors Night of the University of Colombo draws to a successful end. The year 2022, what a roller coaster year. We all thought it's gonna be another pandemic year. However, everything changed at the end. And here we are in the few who brought glory to our alma mater. Organizing such a vibrant event wasn't an easy task. We had high standards to meet, high budgets to achieve, and many more challenges to conquer. But the Amalgamated Club, along with the Department of Physical Education, triumphed over with unrelentless effort and dedication. An event of this magnitude would not be possible if not for the dedication and untiring efforts of many. So today, as the Secretary of the Amalgamated Club 2022, I stand in front of you after completion of two years of sport. On behalf of the Amalgamated Club and the University of Colombo, let me begin by thanking our chief guest, Vice Chancellor, Senior Professor H.T. Karna Ratna for gracing us with his presence today. Thank you, sir, for always being with us and for your continuous support and guiding words of wisdom throughout the year. I would also like to take this moment to express my gratitude to the thoughtful gift, the tie and the sari brooch, which added a touch of elegance to our athletes' attire today. My gratitude goes out to our guest of honor, General Dayal Ratnayaka, for attending tonight and adding color to tonight's event. A special thank goes out to the rector, directors and deans from all the faculties for directing us in the right direction and for the development of sports. And my thanks to the members of the sports board for being the constant pillars we can always lean on. I thank Mr. K.A.S. Edwards, Registrar, University of Colombo, for being here with us today. My sincere gratitude goes out to S.A.N.D. Abe Sundara and Ms. J.T.I. Dharmasena, Acting Bursa, University of Colombo, for helping us make this event a success. My heartfelt appreciation to Dr. Kapila Bandara, Chairman, Sports Board Advisory Board, for the guidance and motivation given to us throughout the year. Also, a special thank goes out to the staff of general administration, staff of finance and supply branch, and the senior medical officers and marshals for being there for us throughout from the beginning to the end without a moment of hesitation. Sponsors, your contribution towards this event is highly appreciated. I would like to specially mention our main sponsor, Hatton National Bank, and our goal sponsors, TAS Physiotherapy, X, and Close Up, in making this event a reality. I thank Mr. Sanjeev Ajay Singha, Acting Director, Department of Physical Education, Mr. Ajanta Dahanayaka, Ms. Vasant Ratnayaka, Ms. Nayanti Chandusena, Mr. Sujan Valgampaya, Ms. Anusha De Silva, Mr. Samina Madhusanka, Ms. Iresha Madhuvanti, and Ms. Mr. Kavindu Abe Singh of Department of Physical Education, without whom this event would not be possible. And also our gym supervisors, Ranjit Asoka and Nandana Kumara for their untiring efforts. We also thank our coaches for their hard work and being the shadow behind our success. It was because of you, dear sir and madam, and your untiring efforts at the Inter-University Games that we stand victorious today, wearing the colors of the university with pride. And also our appreciation is extended towards the Faculty of Medicine for providing us with the venue today. FOSS Media Team, thank you very much for all the support given to us with excellent media coverage. And also Colombo Beacon, FMF Media, for the videos, artworks, and graphic done throughout the year. I extend my appreciation to the dancing troops and performers for adding color and beauty to the event. 
Thank you, Mr. Andrada, the storekeeper, Ms. Damayanti, Shamali, Nishadi, and Mr. Dinuka for supporting us behind the scenes, still playing a main role in making us achieve what we did. And I would like to give my sincere thanks to Nuan, Senaka, Deepal, Dayan, and all the ground staff and gymnasium staff for their untiring efforts, which made all sports schedules run smoothly. Past club members, and especially the Amalgamated Club 2021, Mahin and the committee, and the present club, I thank for the advice and support given to us even at the odd times of the day. Finally, I would like to thank all of you who has been a part of this event in numerous ways. Please bear with me if I have forgotten anyone by name. I cannot stop thanking my colleagues Harit, Imasha, Devinda, Kidmadi, Avishka and Sachin for their amazing commitments. And for all the captains who work day and night with sheer determination and enthusiasm to the maximum of their abilities in order to make this event a success. I could always depend on you to make sure our champions night will be a success. Finally, I would like to thank our families who have been the silent chapters in our success stories. Let me conclude by congratulating all the winners who proudly wear the colors of the university and wishing the number will grow by year, each year. And the flag of the University of Colombo fly high. Thank you very much and have a pleasant evening. Thank you, Sajini. There's a famous quote that states, which you probably have heard many times in your life, that all good things come to an end. So now we have reached to the very end of tonight's proceedings. Have you, Vinuk? Yes, Nimitu. With hopes lit on for the Sri Lanka University Games to be happened in 2023, ladies and gentlemen, we come to an end of the Colors Night 2022. And we invite you all to join with the fellowship dinner which is taking place after these proceedings and also a special announcement by the Team Fast Media that all your photographs can be collected from their stall behind this auditorium. So until we see you again next year with the Champions Night 2023, along with Vinuk, Nimutu and myself, have a great night. long-lasting fragrance. Parents out, home alone? It gives you the confidence to stand out by fighting body odor. The Axe Signature Premium Perfume Range. Nava Close-Up Triple Fresh Formula. Mua ma nava pirisudu karam in visha bija vayta era hiva satan karai. Mua ta then in a sisi lak ek karai. Tavat vishma se in langwenna. Nava Close-Up Triple Fresh Formula.